Peggy 16. It's that time again! Thanks for tuning in! Get ready for another round of newbies! I'm your host, the Joker. I went to Broadway to try and be able to get more character roles, and uh, the Joker is just one of the greatest character roles of all time. The Fortress of Solitude has proven invaluable to me. My favorite role to play in, in, in the DC world would be, uh, would be Superman, because he's such a hard, tough guy, and, uh, you know, he's, he's an American icon. I've got your back. Let's do this. Let's try that other one, too. We couldn't have done it without you. Okay. We couldn't have done it without you. On behalf of the JLA and myself, thank you! <laughs> okay, wait. One more I've been on very welcomed and loved down at Comic-Con and, and, and in the online community. And, uh, gee, I, I, just, I feel very humbled. Metropolis needs a defender. Help me make the streets safe for everyone. That was awesome. Truth, justice, and the American way. So be ready to meet the society head on. Superman out. Hey, heroes, watch your step. I'm enormously uh, uh, fond of Arlene Sorkin. And people have to understand, when she came in to do that first episode, she had no name. It was just like, you know, Joker, hench wench number one. She wasn't called Harley Quinn or anything. And she came in with that off the wall, Judy Holiday delivery. Thanks, Mr. J. And we all just, we just adored her. We just all fell in love with her. Oh, look! Boss fight! It's the ultimate lazy actor's dream. You don't have to memorize your lines. You don't have to do stunt rehearsals. You don't have to, you know, go to wardrobe fittings. Oh, yeah, you gotta get the slippers, because when you work in voiceover, man, you can come, like, in your PJs. It's really comfortable. To come back to a role like the Joker is always a thrill. And, you know, I, I had no idea that I would get so much satisfaction out of doing it in the first place. But, you know, the, it was one of the happiest experiences of my professional career. I love what you've done with the place. You know, it's amazing how the, the, the villain can be as popular and colorful as the heroes themselves. <laughs> I've had more screen time as the Joker than any other actor. Even more than Cesar Romero in the original TV series. Mama, mama. <laughs> you know, I love uh, old time radio and, you know, we were all born too, too late to really participate in it, so this is the next best thing, for sure.